an Apple exec explains an iPhone 10 Face ID hidden security feature. Apple's iPhone 10 drops Touch ID in favor of a 3D face scanning technology Apple calls Face ID. Almost immediately, people had concerns about how it could be defeated by other people. Could someone just point your own phone at you and be able to unlock the device? A developer by the name of Keith Krimble wrote an email about his concerns and sent it directly to Craig Federighi, Apple's senior VP of software engineering. To Krimble's surprise, Federighi replied. Krimble posted the email exchange on Twitter. Krimble asked if the iPhone 10 would require a passcode more often than Touch ID does, referencing the moment during Apple's presentation where Face ID did not work as planned for the Apple senior VP. Federighi replied saying, being locked out of Face ID requires several interactions by other people where they woke up your phone. He says in his day-to-day -day experiences, this has not been a problem. Then there's a security question posed by Krimble. What will prevent a thief from taking my phone, pointing it at my face and running? Federighi explained, if you don't stare at the phone, it won't unlock. He also mentioned, if you grip the buttons on both sides of the phone when you hand over the device, Face ID will be temporarily disabled. There is no mention as to how long this lockout lasts. During Apple's presentation, there was no information about this feature either. The Apple iPhone 10 is not due out until November 3rd. Expect a lot more information about Face ID to trickle out since this is a relatively big change. For all the coverage, check out CNET.com. I'm Maya Zaktar and I'll see you online.